Kevin Samuel just passed away if y'all don't know. I'm telling y'all now he passed away. But look, the thing that just gets on my nerve that I really have to like tell y'all people is how crazy the people are around the internet. I'm on Twitter right now. Post 19 hours ago. Kevin Samuels. You're gonna die alone. God. And you got the Uno reverse card. Simulating that his God's gonna do it towards him. Kevin Samuels has been a man that motivated so much people and it's, it's it's crazy how he gets this backlash for what reason yeah 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 acting mad toxic for what reason this man have yet to do anything to you this man right here he has done nothing but motivate the black community the main reason why i support this man is because he called out what it is and said what it was if you're fat he's gonna be like hey man you're fat you gotta lose weight you're not tall you gotta you know what i'm saying you gotta get muscular you gotta gotta look the best you can and you can't look the best you can if you're acting lazy and if you don't look the best you can you can't expect results from somebody that's in the top one percent he's a, he, he was a person that made sense rationalized things but y'all got people on the internet being bad you're, you're out here talking mad trash to this man for what reason? Like, I'm, we're gonna be on here reading these Twitter replies a little bit and seeing what they're saying. Cause it just, it just don't make, he has a legacy and he's changed many people's lives. He's not, he's not just like, how do I say, selfish. He just blunt and he calls out what it is. If he, if he says you look fat, you look fat. You know what I'm saying? He's an image consultant. That's what he does for a job. And we have people on the internet talking crazy about him. Like he didn't accomplish anything. This man is the godfather of the internet. Like, look for example. If God really took Kevin Samuels and left us with these mofos. Think about it. Megan Thee Stallion. She lied about Tory Lanez. Although it's not confirmed, but we know for a fact, due to lack of evidence, most likely she, most likely she, she is it's, it's false what she, her claims are. Her Amber Heard, terrible human being, she abused Johnny Depp. I don't even want to start with her. And her, she might be the demon of the century. You know, Green Goblin right here. She has twisted and contorted the mind of Will Smith to the point where his name and reputation are completely tarnished. It's even worse than Johnny's death. You know what I'm saying? It's things like this. When you think in comparison to his passing and other people that's living, although it is what it is, it's inevitable. We can't control the inevitable. But just it just it just leaves a bad taste in my mouth where he still had a lot to do and a lot to a lot to accomplish but we still have people like this continuing to be on this earth you know it just it's kind of weird but the thing is look any of y'all that's on that's down in the chat talking down about this man and his passing yeah yeah crazy because this twitter it, 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 it's, it's ridiculous it's disturbing of what y'all be saying about this man you're praising his death you're coming out of woodworks congratulating that he's dead what, what what did i say to you as a person bro oh i hate this man because he kept it real with me i hate this man because he held no punches and he told me how it was I hate this man because he made me realize aspects of my life that I want that I need to change but I don't want to change because I want to be lazy. It just bro this it just don't make no sense bro. It just don't make no sense like let's read this for example. The irony of Kevin Samuels making a career out of telling black women they die single and alone. Yet that's how he died. Not celebrating but be careful how you treat people when you're alive raise a piece to him what do you mean how do you know he was single how you know he died single he had an ex-wife how you don't know he was still talking to his ex-wife you didn't you don't understand his relationships at this 
you can't say he's not single. He probably had a girl, like a girlfriend, a side piece, a fiance. You don't know that. So don't come to a conclusion saying he died by himself, you know? Things like that. But look, R.P. Kevin Simba, I just had to post this there because it's like, it's just crazy. Like, this man is inspiration to a lot of people, the Godfather. And he does a lot of things, bro. If you, if you like this man, put R.P. down in the comments, bro, because he, he, it's crazy.